By now, many of you have probably heard of the Donut SMP, and more likely than not, you may be kind of lost. In this quick tutorial-esque video, I'll be explaining some of the best ways to make money and how not to get scammed. So, without further ado, let's get into it. One of the features you may have used is the slash sell feature, which allows you to sell a variety of items to the server for an okay price. Overall, I would give this method about a 2.5 out of 10, as honestly, the prices are just a lot lower than you could get on our next option. Our next option on the Donut SMP is auction flipping. Now, to do this, first, we need to know exactly what the auction is. In the Donut SMP, the auction house is basically an open market, which allows people to sell dirt from the price of $1 to the price of $1 billion. Now, what you're gonna wanna do with this method is to find a cheap item on the market and resell it for a higher price. I recommend doing this with elytras and other crimson gear you might find. Moving on to our next topic, we have item frame hunting, which is a method that uses anti-duping mechanics on the server to make money. You see, the server disabled crafting of item frames since you could use them for duping. This now makes them a valuable resource since you can only travel to end cities for them. As you can see, I lifted this item frame for about 20k and was purchased within moments. Although this method usually only makes about 20 to 40k, I have gotten lucky before and sold them for an upwards of 300 to 350k, which isn't that surprising considering the guy who bought them had about 3.772 billion dollars made on shop. For our last, but definitely not least method, we have spawner selling and trading. You can easily get spawners through shards, which you can get from kills or being AFK, or gold keys, which you can either buy or randomly get every hour. I doubt you'll have a hard time finding trades, considering there are hundreds of different people asking to trade. But in order not to get scammed, only go first if they have vouchers on them or you trust them from previous trades. Thank you everybody for watching, I linked all the important discords for trade in the description, and if you enjoyed, you can like and subscribe, you guys mean the world to me and it really helps a lot. Thanks.